Hello, I am David the Collector and I'm here with an exciting art unboxing. Today I'm opening up art by Kenny Scharf. You've probably seen his work before. It's all over Los Angeles. He loves to paint cars called car bombs. He paints on the back of TVs. He seems to paint anywhere he can get his hands on. It's really hard to imagine how he even makes all the works that he does. When he presents a show, there's so many pieces. You start to wonder where did these all come from? Uh, I love the work that I have today. Um, this print is by Beyond the Streets and is a colorful smiley face. I was trying to buy an original piece uh, that is quite similar in nature, um, but the original piece is worth 30, 40, 50K um, and the print's only $1,000. So I uh, ended up going with a print instead. His work is very, very recognizable. He has collabed with everyone, including Keith Haring, Andy Warhol, and Jean-Michel Basquiat. He's kind of the, the one guy from that crew who's still practicing today. Uh, so it makes sense he commands this price. Um, if you're interested in checking out Kenny Scharf's work, you can check out it on his website. Let's open up the print first, and then we'll get into the sculptures. Okay, here we go. This top-down view is new. Hope you guys enjoy it. You can see the full unboxing this time. So you can see it, let's flip it this way. I love the rainbow colors on this one. This is uh, the Tondo series he did of a bunch of circles. Uh, looks like this was signed in 2020. It's edition 92 out of 100 with a Beyond the Streets uh, little thing here, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a um, embossment. Um, so really love this one. He made all these by hand and is really known for these characters. The rainbow one I just thought was really cool because of how colorful it was. Let's get into the sculptures. I'll set this aside. Okay, so these sculptures are some vinyls. They're editions of 100. Um, it's a cat and a dog, and I just really had to uh, get these because um, Kenny had a sale, so I was super excited that he was willing to um, sell them a little bit cheaper than he normally does. Looks like he sent some cards, so that's pretty cool. Thank you for the order and support. Please use this note card to say hello to someone you, in, you love. Enjoy Kenny Sharp. so with the receipt. Set this aside down there. So a really cool little card that you can resend as just sort of a bonus gift. You can tell he's been in the game in a while. He's got the merch sorted. So let's check it out. So the first one we'll check is the dog eye. Here he is. And the second one is the cat eye guy. So yeah, the pink and green are again my favorite colors. I've been wanting to get a hold of these for a while um, and they are pretty easy to buy. You can still get them from his website. Um, they go for about $450 each, but because it was Black Friday, he ran a deal and they were only $350. Um, let's read the back. It looks like the edition size is even bigger than I thought, it's 2,500. I think on the website it's listed as 1,000, but I'd have to double check that. Uh, born in 1958 in Hollywood, California, Kenny Scharf spent much of his childhood watching two inches from this television, two inches from the screen, as he tells it. So yeah, very, very cool. Um, talks about uh, Fred Flintstone and some of the characters he used early on. Um, and there's an artist catalog included. It looks like these were made in 2004. I'm not gonna open up these boxes, as you know. Oh wait, let's check it out. It looks like they're not even sealed, so. Maybe we'll open them up. Oh. The box itself is normally a valuable part of the exchange. You don't want to break it open because then it's less a valuable resell, but we might display these, so why not? Here's a little booklet that I think is cool. Again, this is the same text from the back, but just has some pictures on it. Oh yeah. Some more photos. When worlds collide. Pretty cool. Let's oh, there's a whole nother booklet. Oh, this just looks like a, um... oh, it's another booklet of art that they've made over the years. So all the little additions. This was, I guess, one of the first companies. Um, some cool pieces by Nara. He has a show at LACMA, um, an ashtray, so. Works with some cool people, some other of the Kenny Scharf stuff. It's pretty sick. 
pretty cool. Oh, and even Murakami, let's a ball and um, some of these uh, soft plushes by um, by Yoyoi Kusuma, Kusama. It's very cool. And last but not least, let's take a peek at, oh, I lost my little knife. Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Cool, we found it. Okay, back to. Very cool, completely intact, even the whiskers. So I always thought that was such a cool element of this piece. Wow, it's definitely um, a little bit different feeling than most vinyls. It's pretty heavy and like, listen, it's a different sound than a vinyl normally makes. So yeah, very, very cool. I don't think I'm gonna open up the other one quite yet, but thank you so much for watching. Again, if you're curious, you can buy these on Kenny Sharp's website. You can also follow him on Instagram to follow along in all of his antics and to see all of the cool characters that he paints and what he's painting them on. Um, please like and subscribe. You can follow me on Instagram if you're curious about what new videos I have coming. Thank you, have a good one.